Welcome back to the Grey Hill Incident. Um, this is part two. Uh, I know, hopefully, within just a little bit of time after I finish, I'm going to sit down and I'm going to actually put just a little bit of time. Part that we are. I'm going to put the correct thumbnail. Um, so it might have the wrong thumbnail. To start with, but all right, let's go ahead. Uh, so we were collecting. We need to collect five things of tin foil. These alien jerks are everywhere. And um, yeah, so let's get back into it. Okay, that's crouch. That's our bat. So we got to be careful. They can't hear me, but they're like literally everywhere. It's so hard to see. Now, if I remember correctly, there was one in this room. There's our cabinet. We spent a lot of time in that cabinet. Is he walking away? <sighs> Looks like it. Yeah, I did watch some other people playing this. Not very much, but a lot of other people made some of the same complaints I did. Like, about the stamina taking way too long to recharge. Damn 
Come on! Whatever. <coughs> and the part that sucks is that you gotta start all over from the checkpoint. <sighs> I'm starting to wonder if I'm ever gonna make it past this. <sighs> Try again. Okay, hiding in the outhouse was not a great idea. If two are on you, there's like no chance. All right, we're gonna go for the house one first. Because we know we're gonna get it immediately attacked by that one. First, we're gonna open this door. Let's sleep. Whoa! Get away from me! What the hell? Total bull. I'm trying really hard not to swear. Let's just go in here. Get these doors open.
Okay. <clears throat> He's inside searching for me. While we wait, I'm going to go ahead and share this on X. Just for the record, we are playing this on the PS5, and this is an indie game. <coughs> Alright, he should be gone now. Now this house should be empty. So we can go in and get the one in this house. Casey comes in. So let's see, we got three. And I think I know who the last two are. Just gotta get out of this house. Where's that table? There it is. 
You gotta be kidding me. I can't just walk around. Oh, wait a minute. This is the bar. Shit. Okay, so there's house one, house two, house three, and then the bar. I thought the bar was on the other side of the street. Why is the open sign in the back? Because we're behind the houses. If we could just find this last one, we can get in. Crap. kidding me no freaking way come on there there's got to be a way to change the difficulty no what is that huh that's weird we don't want that on. <laughs> it already is bad enough.
I don't know why, but for some reason that j music when it plays really does get me jumping. Come on. I knew you were in there. How many of there are you? Can you run like you're being chased? Jeez. Like, la, 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 I, I'm just going to run slow. I don't have three or four aliens behind my ass. No. If I get caught, there's no way, no way I'm going to be able to get out of it. God, dude, you run and walk so slow. safe in our box. They better not find me. <clears throat> this is how you know this is all purely me. Not like a cheat run or anything because... If it were, I wouldn't be getting caught this and killed this much. Sounds like. I think he just left. Okay, there's one.
grab two, which is right over here. which is right here. All right. I think there's a house from... There should be a house right next door. Oh, come on. Get it. kidding me come on really oh son of a oh it's ticking me off you know, I've been told I'm slow but god this guy makes me look like Speedy Gonzales I guess I should have opened that door. And that, like, even the shadow looks so weird. <laughs> Run! Come on! There's an alien behind you! Alright. He has no clue I'm in here. Hi, Matt. How you, how's your night going? Glad you could tune in. <sighs> now I just gotta wait for him to leave. And I think that's my cue. To get a drink. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. If I can't hide here, then... Ridiculous. I guess that one wasn't stupid this time. He's like, I know he went in this house. I know he went in this room. He's somewhere. Usually, if they know that I'm there, they come right after me, like, right away. That guy took a few minutes.
The point of this game is I don't know yet. <laughs> right now, my mission is to find five things of tinfoil and then go to the bar. And I've located all five, I just can't get to them and avoid the aliens. And I have the baseball bat, but he swings it like a weirdo. And his stamina is so freaking low. And as soon as we open this, I know there's going to be an alien. Come on. Shoot. He's probably going to find me. I didn't close that front door to slow him down. I have no clue what they're shooting at. See, once we got that, once that guy is gone, we can go grab the tinfoil in that house. Then I can easily, hopefully, grab the others without getting chased anymore. Yeah, it does. At first, you're like, at this point now, since I've been stuck in this freaking section for so long, it's kind of worn down. Now it's just aggravating. <laughs> All right, I just heard the front door close, so he should be gone. He didn't even check this room. Can't hardly see out these windows. Three down, two to go. All right, four down. Is this all in this house? I hardly been in this house. It's a good closet to hide in. Can't go that way. Grab it and move on. That should be enough. Yeah, good. She has to be in the diner. Yay. Where's Amy? She should be here. Dude, you're the only one left. Grab a drink, build some stamina, and let's get the F out.
We're in the barn in front of the diner, Amy. You don't want to take that. You know, the aliens might know our language. Only useful thing I've done with this bat. Get through doorways. No ammo. We do have a revolver, but, um... It doesn't really do much from what I've seen. front of the diet. Well, I see the bar. Okay, open it. You give me the prompt. I'm pushing the button, but it's not opening. It's got to open. It's the only way I can get in. Unless I should exit later. Yeah, let's head towards the creepy bolt light. Inside that UFO. Meanwhile, I've been trying to get to Brandon's house because he's in trouble too. We'll help you, Ryan. The cars don't drive anymore, but maybe this old biplane does. We could use the biplane to get near the UFO. The UFO is parked in front of my house. But I guess it's our only option. I could hop a fence and be what over there. Do you get close? How the hell are we going to get inside of that thing? I don't know. Maybe Matt has a solution for that. He is oh, on the farm. God. Do you, Matt? Do you have a solution? All right. And by the way, that officer you called, they got him. They imprisoned him in a barn somewhere around town. I no, he put himself in a barn. Gray Hill in a squad car. I never called the police. <coughs> Brandon yeah? But I thought you don't listen to our chief. Usually, I don't listen to him. This time, I did. But who called him then? I don't know. I'll go talk to Matt now. Yeah, if we can find him. Ryan, we'll find a solution to rescue him. Yeah. <sighs> Got trophy for a dumb idea. It sounds about right in this day and age. Is that you? Uh, I don't think so. I can't go back. Anything else in this house? I need to find the key. 
Are you kidding me? Now you gotta find a stupid key. Oh, and they're back. I can hear them out there. So now I gotta go look for a stupid key. They'll never suspect that I would hide in the same place. If it wasn't for all these stupid walls, I could think of much better places to be going. And if my character was just a little faster, I could outrun these gray wads. thing is, where would this key be? I was supposed to be looking for Matt, not a key. Still can't get out that door, huh? <sighs> Why do they put this in here if it's not going to move? Back in the closet. Seems to be an ongoing trend in this game. Closet hopping. Don't tell me he gave up already. Key, 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 key. Come on, I gotta find a key. Where's the stupid key? Why do they have all these pallets? Jeez.
I mean, I found a gas can. I know that's going to probably be... Oh, well, yeah, I need to fuel the plane. I just need to get out of this little area. And I probably need the key in order to do that. Okay, it's got to be in this section here. Really, I can only come in from this side? That seems stupid. Oh, thank you, Matt. Odd looking key. Key's bigger than my hand. safe and now I'm I'm lost in here oh shit okay um, at least you're safe I don't know the code but I'll look for it so just hang on <laughs> well wait, 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 wait. Ryan you don't think that they um you know probe us when we become abducted what I don't know man they abducted Henry Try not to think about that right now. Just hang on and let me get you out of there. All right. We'll help you. Please. Please look for the code. My back hurts already. But maybe oh, you're sure poor the code back. Can follow you into this room. Otherwise, you have to lure them away. Why? What's in this room that they could want? What are you hiding? And wait a minute, how'd you get in there? If you know the code, just tell me the code. Oh, I can hide under a bed. Great. Okay, he's in the safe. I don't know the code. Go get him, guys. Bye. <laughs> Make me look for a stupid code. <coughs> no, 
1969, I'm guessing. Why am I not surprised? What are they, like, burning their mark or something? Room cleared. We checked this one. Aliens near. Please kill them. I won't come out otherwise. I won't. Flipping kidding. Okay, what's the checkpoint here? Did I get the key? No. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm locked in here. Yeah, I know. Matt, Go find the code. What are you doing in there? Do I have to stay by you to keep you talking? Aliens came and I... <coughs> I hid in the safe. <coughs> yes, I did. In here. Oh, shit. Okay, um... I don't know the code, but I'll look for it. So just hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Ryan, you don't think that they can, you know, probe us when we become abducted. Of course they probe us. I don't know, man. They abducted Henry. I'm trying not to think about that right now. Just hang on and let me get you out of there. We'll help you. Please. Please for the code. They probably wonder why the hell we have buttholes. They probably just vomit up whatever. Otherwise, you have to lure them away. They eat only what their bodies actually absorb, so they don't have buttholes to expelliate waste. And they're so fascinated by the concept that our bodies take in more. There, I just answered the age-old question of why aliens give us anal proofs. Because <laughs> they're fascinated by it. They don't understand the concept.
So you're telling me you eat food and you drink stuff, and there's so much that the, your body doesn't absorb that you have to expel it through the small hole in your lower half of your body? Interesting. We must find out how it works. Okay, all seriousness, guys. There's nobody in the safe in that room. Repeat, there's nobody there. Just I had to go mute for a minute. Sorry about that. I had a phone call. And now they're all left. Okay. They followed me into the house. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? There's an outhouse back here I can hide in. He'll never find me now. Okay, can you get your breathing under control before he does find me? I think like just ran a marathon. Well, I'll can of gasoline one. work? You just better have that plane ready. Why do we need a plane? It's literally on the ground. It hasn't moved. Oh my gosh. This game, I swear. It landed in a field right in front of my house and we're talking about getting in a plane for something that's on the ground <clears throat> Ooh, excuse me Bring it to the barn door. That looked like a can of gasoline, not a barrel of.
kerosene. Did they all disappear now? How do I get in? Ryan! Ryan, can you hear me? Huh? A pawn! I can hear you! What happened? I'm not sure. I... <coughs> I can't think straight. They cut me. Bad. I think I got away before they could finish. They put something in me. It's cold to the touch. Some kind of metal, maybe. I'm almost at the church. Can you see it? Meet me inside. We need to talk about next steps. All right, I'll be right there. Now I can open it. A great cloud with a fire enfolding itself, and the brightness round about it, and out of the mist thereof as if it were glowing metal, out of the mist of the fire, and out of the mist thereof came the likeness of four living creatures. And this was their appearance. They had the likeness of a man, Father and every one had Ryan. Don't you hear that I'm preaching? Stop interrupting me! Did you see a police officer come through here? His name is Apone. And you think he can secure you from the angels of God? The Father! Those uh, are the, these are the people that scare me the most. And... They abducted my son and I need to save him. Who knows what they're doing to him? Ryan, he is in God's hands. What do you think will I give that the angels take me? Your son is blessed. It begins. It begins now. Don't tell me I gotta find another key. <clears throat> what is this box? Why is there just a box here? Ah, oh, well, he's definitely a religious man. Serves him right. Actually, I'm kind of glad I'm not in that room anymore. Come to think of it. So, nothing to do in the church. Great. Am I locked? I'm locked in the church. Oh, great. This is just what I need. Oh, I gotta go back in this room. Thank God I don't have a black light. There's nothing in here. The book of uh. 
the... I can't make out the small words. Church of Grey Hill. I think my game just broke because I'm stuck. Okay, that was weird. Yeah, I'm stuck. <laughs> There's no way out. Thought I saw something for a second. No. Yeah. Oh. There we go. I did have to find another key. Of course. That'd be nice if it actually told me that. I gotta find the key out of here or something. Opponent, I'm here. Ryan, glad to finally meet you. Listen, these motherfuckers, they, they probed me. It hurts. <laughs> I can't help you anymore. But here's What's the that? number of the man that sent me here. Take it. They took my son. Do you know how to get him back? Call the number. I'll know what to do. He'll help me find your son. Did you just pull that out of your Stop ass? This invasion. He's done this before. Don't call anybody else. Not the police. Not the government. They won't help you. Not unless you want to end up in the psych ward if you survive all this. Only trust the man on this number. <laughs> I never thought I'd die in a goddamn graveyard. <laughs> hey, at least you'll have a short trip. <clears throat> Goodbye, Pone. great dear Pone. officer. Don't die, goddammit. Where the fuck am I going to find a working phone? I don't even know what year this is. Nope, still can't go out those doors. Smallest graveyard I've ever seen. Oh, can't go that way. A checkpoint. <clears throat> All right.
Maybe there's a back door. Why is that one just hanging out there? Oh my god, this is the same house we were in earlier. Are you flipping kidding me? It looks like it. Don't know if he saw me. He didn't see me. There was no one there. The door just shut on its own. <clears throat> All right. I guess he didn't see me. God, these aliens are blind. Is he still following me? I think he gave up. I had a pretty far lead. Any phones in here? Ew. And why are we touching it? He's coming right towards me. He's not coming in here. Yeah. <laughs> 
Come on! No! We're safe for a moment. Okay. We're good. I think I lost him. Of course, the last time I said that, I immediately got caught right after, so... I will say this, as far as the gameplay and sound design goes, it's really good. You can actually hear them walking around if they're at a distance or if they're close by. You can hear them open and close doors. I have zero clue what I'm really supposed to be doing. Find a working phone to call the number.
Hmm. And the circuit board is broken. Where the hell am I gonna find one of those? I don't know. <coughs> <coughs> Hey, this actually might work. How convenient. There. That should about do it. Now time to call this mystery man. From where? Maybe I should turn around. I haven't actually seen any phones. there. Back in the anal probe house. God dang it. And it's still no phone. Is there a phone in here that I missed? No, no phone in here. Okay, there's no way people live in a house this big. Gotta be in this house.
That's right, just keep walking. Why not? What's that way? It's away from the aliens. I think I'm going in the wrong direction. Come on, move it, move it, move it, move it, move it. Needs like a stamina meter, a sanity meter. <clears throat> like that, like killing it would have just gave me a lot of points towards stamina or sanity. There's either a house or something in one of the houses I missed.
you are seeing things. I hear a wood creaking like he's standing there. Did you go away? I'm not staying in there all night. How rude. He didn't even close the door. What a jerk. I guess that's where I gotta go next. Is it trying to tell me this house? back are we Yeah, there's a bullet in here.
Hey, this actually might work. There. That should about do it. Now time to call this... Mystery Man. I thought I found like three bullets. And I found one this time. Oh, there's the other two I found. So I was right in there. Sorry, the person you're calling is not available at this moment. Please check the number and try again. Uh, uh hey, my name's Ryan. I'm calling from Greyhill. Your friend Depone gave me this number. He, he's dead. I'm, I'm sorry. He told me that he came too late and that I should call this number. Depone is dead. Ryan, did he tell you about using tinfoil? And if so, do you have enough? I have five rolls. Yeah, I got it. I could probably cover my whole body with that. On board one of those fucking ships. Opponent said you can help me. Yeah, I can. Now listen to me and do what I tell you. Wrap your entire body in the tin foil. Completely cover yourself head to toe and let them abduct you. I know this sounds crazy, but if you want your son back. You have to trust me. I'm a Russian Indian. Or Native American. Right. Trust me. Who exactly are you? And how do you know this works? <clears throat> Hold on. I got another call coming. <laughs> Alright, that's it. God, I look like an idiot. How can I let them abduct me if... And they took off without you! Matt, can you hear me? Oh, fuck. I'll try it again later. Where's the plane? I don't hear them anymore. They left you. Because <clears throat> they're not stupid.
I'm right here. <coughs> what are you waiting for? Huh? What are you waiting for? Come get me. Oh, there should be one walking by any minute. Maybe I look like a they're predators, like they're arch nemesis, the ones that are killing them all. Maybe they're not into robots. Maybe they're like, oh no, it released a sunbeam from its hand, a metal robot with a sun gun. I think the blinking lights are telling me where I need to go. Did my game glitch or something? Well, they were flying in this general direction, so... If I'm supposed to go after them, well, which way are we supposed to go? I think I'm going in the wrong direction. I don't think you are. Okay, so what is the objective? Find a way onto the field. Jump the fence? Maybe I should turn around. What? See, there's the ship right there. Oh, there's a couple ships. We can just go right up to them and knock on the side and say, Let me in. Take me to your leader. Oh, what? Jesus Christ. It's a goddamn UFO parking lot out here. Right? Why? You're trying to get in. You dummy. Something is wrong with Amy and Matt. They started the biplane to rescue Henry, but I don't know where they are, and I can't hear the plane anymore. They might have been taken by those things. Hey, where are you? What's your plan? 
I'm pretty close to Brandon's house. This detour took way longer than expected. I hope he's okay. I don't have time to explain everything, but this cop I met, they got him. He's dead. Oh my god. No. That door is locked. He sent to warn us by a mysterious man who I contacted. And he told me the only way to rescue Henry is to dress up in tinfoil and let them abduct me. I know, I know. It sounds crazy, but if it's the only shot I have to get Henry back, I have to try. Yes! That could work! Well, at least to avoid them going into your brain. I'll guide you once you're in it. Or my butt. Sounds good. Make sure you get your van up and running. Once I get Henry, we'll drive out and meet with the mysterious man. He can help us figure this all out. Wait, Bob. That that sounds like Amy's walkie. That's Amy. Amy! Amy, are you there? Amy! I can't hear you! Can you hear me? That was Brandon's kid. She's still in the house. Henry! I'm coming for you! God damn it! Fuck! No! Please, no! God! Get your fucking fingers out of my dirty ass! Is that Brandon? What the fuck are they doing to him? They think they're all in the same shit. What in the hell should I do now? Why am I walk? Why does my shadow look so weird? Well, somebody had a fun time without me. I shouldn't go that way. Which way am I supposed to go? something to break this door. Guess my baseball bat won't do the trick. Rachel! Ryan! Um, what are you wearing? Oh, man. <laughs> this so is like fog graphics, this, for got the people. Bed, they got daddy! Uh, they got yeah. daddy! Oh, shit. Come on, Fergie. My dad said the is about everything. <laughs> well, he's right. But don't worry, though. I'll protect you. I have to get on that saucer to save him, so I'll bring you to Bob, okay? I can watch after you until I come you back can't with dad. Me. My dad says you're a weakling, and you can't protect anybody. Well, he I'm out here, and your dad's in there. Uh, well, I 
know he's your dad, but don't believe everything he says. And besides, I killed a few of those aliens on the way over here. Oh, yeah, Dad's right. Like, oh, shit. What? Where is your son? <coughs> they got him, too. Ryan, that sounds like a car. What? They must be driving through town stopping for gas or something. No, where are you going? Stay! Ugh! What the fuck is going on with this kid? She's psycho! Teaching his daughter. You know what? Just save your own kid. Leave the rest of them. Oh, great. How do I get out of here? I find that little brat. I think I'm going in the wrong direction. So it feels like somebody took uh, inspiration from Silent Hill 2. Combined it with the graphics of Fallout 3. To make this game. Thought maybe I could find some supplies in there, but nope. Can't even try to go in there. Looking for a child at a cornfield. This does not normally bold well. Am I gonna run into he who walks behind the rose? Oh wait, I'm the one. I'm he who walks behind the rose. Ha! Ah. See what I did there? Pretty funny. Where you at, kid?
Where are you? Okay, so anybody wondering if I'm just aimlessly running around in a cornfield, uh, that would be a yes, most definitely. I'm hearing things, so naturally I'm progressing. Somehow. But I'm not seeing anything. maybe there was like some kind of path like a maze <coughs> a maze within maze okay so the jokes are all gonna be that great where Can you give me a landmark to look for? On you little brat, where are you at?
Keep making noise. Um, did I just get stuck? I thought I saw something. Huh, we got a light. That is it. Let them take me. That's what we were supposed to. Oh, Rachel, she's still here. But that's what we're supposed to do. Are you kidding me? Them take me. Oh, Rachel, she's still here.
Rachel! What the hell? Looks like the light from the shed. Ryan! Ryan, are you here? Ryan! Yeah, Bob! A few of them greeted me some minutes ago. While I was out working on the caravan. Yeah, after taking a photo shoot, I asked them if they wanted to have some coke, but... Bob, it's okay. All good. I got it. Just joking! I imprisoned one in the bedroom, and I put a tinfoil hat on him. I'm gonna make some experiments. But I won't probe him. Bob, I swear. Please stop. Uh, maybe sell him on the black market. got Brandon's daughter, so I'm a little busy. Uh, okay. I found a solution to make the caravan work. It'll take me a few minutes to oh, get it done. Bob, that's great. That's what I needed to hear. It'll be our chance to get out of this town. I have to save Rachel first. She's trapped in the barn by the gas station. I'm going to get her, then we can make a plan to save Henry. Yes, Ryan. We have to be fast with Henry. God, I hope they didn't start drilling into his teeth. Bob, can you not say shit like that? I don't even want to think about it. Yeah, I heard Brandon Bob. heard causing trouble for them on the saucer through Amy's walking. I think they're all on the same shit. That's good. Okie doke. Bye, Ryan. Jesus. Rachel is in there. Why the hell did they use a bike chain to lock the gate? It's crazy. Big bolus head. No! Rachel's in there. Why the hell did they use a bike chain to lock the gate? It's crazy. I'm gonna have to find some bolt cutters or something to get through there. Why can't anything ever go smoothly? Right.
Come on. Hey, you little Rachel, I'm here. Brat. Whoa, dude! Yeah. <laughs> Rob, I've always wanted to see. Glad you're here. And the caravan's working. I'm gonna put Rachel in your bedroom. She needs rest. Jeez. Bob, seriously. Imprisoned an alien. I, I told you I did it, dude. Just lay around the carpet. But again, I didn't probe him. Didn't probe him. Just put a tinfoil hat on. Ha uh ha. -huh. So funny. I think he's one of their dentists, not one of their butt drivers. That doesn't sound good. I'll go out and try and get its attention. I need to get it to abduct him. It's my only shot at getting Henry back. Oh, now we can I get abducted? Can take Rachel with you. I'm gonna work with your mysterious friend today to bring all this to the public. All right. His number is five 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 zero one nine nine. Call him as soon as possible. Bob, all right. I gotta go. Thank you. Stay safe. Hey, uh, Ryan. You know, you were the only one who didn't think I was crazy. Thanks for that, man. I love you. <coughs> of course it's blocked up now. <coughs> Here we go. Dark in here. Is that it? All right, see ya. Is that seriously it? We gotta wait for the sequel now? Uh, yep. Things seem to have worked out pretty good for Rachel and me. Uh, I hate that we don't know what happened on the UFO to Ryan and the others, but... Well, after Ryan was abducted, his dog Max came along, and together we're now on our way to meet this mysterious man. I mean, that was the Grey Hill incident. Except for a new book, yeah? God, I hope I'll find a publisher this time. Rambling again. Well, I hope you folks enjoyed yourself. Catch you on later down the road. Are you kidding me? Hey, Rachel. What was your favorite part about the story of Grey? Mm. Mom? Who are you just talking to? <coughs> are you flipping kidding me? What? 
I thought I at least like have to save the kid and get away. <coughs> and I'm probably gonna get a copyright claim for this song. This is what? <laughs> this is so ridiculous. No wonder they made it so hard, because they want to make sure that you actually get some worth out of the game. It's got a good song at the end, at least, but... That's seriously it. Oh my god. All right. Well, that was the Grail incident. I guess we're going to have to wait and see if they ever come out with a sequel to this game. Maybe it'll be better because of the people that actually. I mean, it looked really great and it was doing okay until that. I didn't think it would just end like that, but. I mean, it wasn't that expensive of a game, so I think it was like 35 bucks. I pre-ordered it, so I have to go back and check how much I spent, but it's not that long. So if you want to check it out, I'd say wait and see if they make a Grey Hill Incident 2. But if you really want, you can check it out. Um... It's an interesting play. So I guess that's going to go ahead and end this. Please, if you like me doing this, let me know in the comments below. Um, if there's other games you'd like to see me play, let me know. Uh, yeah, so that was the Grey Hill Incident. And I guess I will see you all later. Please like, comment, and if you haven't, subscribe to the channel. I give away free movie codes every time I reach a new set of 10 subscribers. So it's definitely worth checking out. All right. Bye.